For those who have ever suffered a broken heart on Valentine's Day, there could actually be a true medical condition responsible. Takotsubo cardiomyopathy, or broken heart syndrome, was discovered in 1991 by Japanese scientists and named after its similar appearance to a takotsubo, or Japanese octopus pot. Its symptoms mimic a heart attack but present differently once doctors take a closer look. Dr. Amir Lotfi, a cardiologist in the Heart and Vascular Program at Bay State Medical Center, has treated patients for the temporary condition. He says it's typically brought on by a very stressful and often unexpected situation, such as the death of a loved one, fear, and yes, even a breakup. They found um, individuals who present with symptoms of a heart attack, EKG changes that are suggestive of a heart attack, but when they did an angiogram, which is taking pictures of the blood vessels of the heart, they, don't, they noticed that there wasn't any significant narrowing or blockage. However, they found that the, the muscle of the heart did in certain areas didn't contract as well. The highest probability are postmenopausal women, but um, in literature you can see it in young people, men, um, older men, younger men. So th this has been shown in multiple um, cohorts of people. Just as time heals the emotions of a broken heart, since there is no loss of muscle like with a heart attack, most patients usually return to normal within a week or two. With news from Bay State Health, I'm Jade Rivera McFarland.